Good evening and thanks for joining us. I'm Laura Yamada. And I'm Paula Akana. The playoffs for the high school football state championship begin tonight. And in Waianae, a team that was once out is now getting to host tonight's game. KITV4's Dick Algeyer joining us live from Waianae High School. Dick? And it just goes to show you never know what's going to happen. Sometimes in sports, the ball can take a funny bounce. People didn't expect this. It's kind of a convoluted story. Let me explain. Why and I, with a losing record, was supposed to be out of the state tournament. Kahuku, undefeated, looking to win. Suddenly, it was revealed that they had an ineligible player. They had to forfeit. They were disqualified from the state tournament one week ago on the eve of the playoffs. They filed a lawsuit. They tried to get a temporary restraining order, trying to get Kahuku back into the game. A judge turned that down, so now here they are playing. And the people out here in Waianae were watching that lawsuit closely. We talked to some members of the girls' soccer team just a few minutes ago, and here's what they had to say about watching that lawsuit and getting into the tournament. I was watching it because my parents just turned it on. So I was kind of excited that they said that why not he's going to keep going? When we first found out, everybody was excited. They were like, because Kahuku um, got disqualified. So they're excited to win and stuff and continue playing. So they will be playing tonight at 7 o'clock. People are just getting to the stadium now. We'll be here getting more fan reaction. And Jemai Webster will be having more on the sports angle of this, talking to the coaches a little bit later, live from Waianae. I'm Dick Allgaier, reporting live from Waianae. All right, thanks a lot, Dick. And we want to know your thoughts about the championship title. Who do you think is going to win the state high school football championship? Do you think it'll be Kealakehi, Lelehua, Mililani, St. Louis, or Waianae? If you'd like to take part in our survey, just go to the homepage of our website at KITV.com.